eloquent illustrative stories that provoke thought. And I've always loved the parable of the sower and the seed. That's how I live my life. When I give people facts that I've spent years and hours looking up, researching, reading, thoroughly enjoyed it. So, uh, you know, I'm not in any way complaining, but I give them the facts and they go, ah, rubbish, because they just simply don't know. And they don't know that they can trust McClure. I mean, I had a woman last night and I put up that, you know, uh, we're looking for subscribers for Scottish YouTube. And she said to me, is this some kind of scam? And I thought, what a disgraceful thing to say about anyone, least of all, or most of all, Scotty McClure, you know, one of the most trusted people on the planet, you know, for goodness sake. Anyway, I had to explain to her that subscribers, no money changes hands. It's absolutely free to listen to Scotty McClure. And I was giving of my time for people like that. Anyway, she did apologize and then disappeared. <laughs> so there we are. So I don't know if it was a troll or uh, if it was just uh, just somebody because there's quite a lot of jealousy out there for some reason. Uh, you know, if you pop up and talk to people, people are like, oh, I think she's somebody or not. In that case, there we are. So you're boiling up soup and you're sharing it with everyone. So Welly Song, what was behind all of that story? I must remember to finish my stories sometimes. What was behind all that is the feeding of the 5,000. Now, you can be a doubting Thomas and think, don't be ridiculous. How could you, with five loaves and two fishes, how could you possibly feed 5,000? But you see, it's interesting. Say you went to some big outdoor game or some conference. You can't do it now with COVID, but say you went to something like that and there were 5,000 people there and you were told to bring something to eat, a packed lunch or something. So you think, well, I've only got a few bananas and some wee sandwiches and some, some uh, you know, megabytes, some terabytes or whatever. And you've got that there. And then somebody says, uh, there are some people in the crowd who I don't think have understood that they were meant to bring something to eat at this point, folks. I think they thought that there would be a canteen, but we can't at the moment, I'm afraid, blah, blah, blah. And then people say, so if you see somebody, if you've got uh, anything to spare, then that would be, I'm sure, very welcome. And if people started turning around and saying, listen, we've got lots of wee sandwiches, would you like one? Oh, thanks very much. That's awfully good of you. We didn't know whether to bring something or not. You know, no, not at all. In fact, I'm just saying lady here's, her and her husband, they didn't know to bring stuff. You know, all oh, right. Oh, well, here, have some of ours. Look, we've got big bags of crisps here and everything. And you end up feeding the 5,000. Interesting. So there we are. So you're boiling up the soup. You, you wish you could share it with everybody, and you have done. Everybody's going, oh, we feel as if we've had some soup. I was at Whitby. This is Betty. This is great. Betty McIver. I was at Whitby during the week. Surprised. It was very busy. I put on a mask as it was pretty crowded. I know what you mean, Betty. Yes. Are you trying to rebuild your PC or laptop? Well, I was, I was thinking about the PC, but I think it was pretty slow, the, 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 the PC. I bought it about probably about 16, 17 years ago. And it is a cracker, but I think they're quite slow, uh, you know, from that point of view. Um, and I don't think it would have a lot of mem. Although a friend of mine did put new mem in it. They got the details and popped some new, some more RAM into it. Um, so it's the laptop we're talking about, J Dog. Wonderful. So there we are. So laptop time, I say. Yeah, and I've got to. I've got an extra keyboard with it because the keyboard stopped working. But I found out that that can probably be sorted as well. So there we are. So I'll be looking into all that. Fantastic, and uh, and we'll see what's what. Wonderful. So, Betty, was it Whitby? Anybody anywhere else that we'd like to be? Uh, 